Hello guys, it's Simon from Wet Nose Gaming here. Uh, I am playing Space Engineers, which is uh, Early Access Alpha on Steam. Um, and I'm going to show you uh, whatever the hell you'd call this thing today. Uh, this is just my design of it. I suppose you'd call it a railgun or catapult or whatever. Um, but as there are no functioning weapons in the game, you can see, if I get this up, there are weapons, but they don't work. The, as it's only an alpha stage, they're being balanced and tested by the developers and whatever. Um, so, I've sort of thrown this together. Um, to Its design is basically to propel this block here, which is made up of uh, small blocks. You can see that. Um, along a huge rail network uh, made of large blocks and to impact with that big cube over there um, to see how far it penetrates, which is surprisingly a lot. Um, anyway, the design is reasonably simple, even though it looks very complicated. Um, it's basically just a small ship, is this cradle thing with generators and engines, uh, and landing gear just to sort of stop it breaking on the rail, although it sometimes does randomly break anyway. Uh, when you come to braking at the other end, sometimes some of the landing gear snap off and damage the cradle a bit, um, but it doesn't really do too much. Um, it's pretty random though, sometimes the whole thing will break a little bit, sometimes it's absolutely fine. Sometimes it ruins the accuracy and just flies off at a random angle. Sometimes it hits the target dead on. Um, but it's all a reasonable success rate, I'd say. Um, and something I will just show you first of all, thanks to the new uh, magnetic landing gear that they've just added in a patch, um, what you can do is get in the small ship, just reverse it up a little bit, press P, you see the landing gear at the back have gone yellow, press P and they go green, and then it is completely stuck, it won't move, it's magnetically attached to the rail, so then you can fly the whole thing around, if you wanted, um, so you could attach, build a whole ship around this thing, and you've got a weapon for a ship, um, but I'm not going to mess around with that today, I'm going to detach it, um, and just try and show you the firing mechanism. Um, I will just say, this is my version of this thing. I'm sure there are plenty of other people who've made much better polished versions. Uh, this is just sort of thrown together. Uh, as I said, sometimes it breaks. Um, but yeah, just fiddle around with it yourselves. And hopefully you'll be able to make a much better version than this. Um, if I just unlock that, so now the whole rig moves. Um, and to un uh, secure this, you just delete a block here, and you notice this, the charge now is completely free flying, it's just pushed by these landing gear. Um, and I'm going to try, and hopefully it won't break the whole rig, but it sometimes does. Um, I'm going to try and show you the test fire. So all you do is accelerate to full speed, as you can see over the right there. Um, should get up to about 104, um, and then when it gets to that, you just let go and it breaks automatically and the block that we just detached flies forward and smashes into the cube to quite good effect so I'll just show you that now okay we couldn't have had much of a better test fire for that I don't think anything broke which is always good uh, I think all the landing gear are still attached oh no here we go right yeah, some of the landing gear has broken off down here, um, but it's a reasonably simple repair, but maybe if I aligned the cradle better, that wouldn't have happened, but again, this is just very basic design. Um, okay, now the cube that I've been firing at, um, you can obviously see it's torn right in there, I think is 10 blocks, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, yep, it's 10 blocks thick. Um, and again, the penetration is really pretty random. Um, I've seen it get up to the yellow, the second yellow here, so that's nine blocks through. Um, but sometimes it only gets to the grey, sometimes the red. It's pretty random. I mean, 104 for that cradle is top speed. 
Um, but yeah, we only got through to the red this time. But that's pretty devastating hit, really. And this is actually some of the charge left over, just floating, floating around in here. Um, and obviously, this is the cube is made up of big blocks, and the charge is only small blocks. Which is, if you've ever crashed a small ship into a large ship, the large ship always comes off better. But the speed that this is going, it really does destroy a huge amount of this. So that's a pretty effective weapon if you could. Uh, make it work properly without crashing every time and breaking. Um, another thing I'd like to try is to scale it up to be able to shoot big blocks, but that's a whole other thing. Um, but yes, thank you very much for watching this uh, early access footage of Space Engineers. Uh, hope you enjoyed it.